Yeah, maybe at the end we could bring up the video game awards and last year's performance of when they did the games of the year and they had that giant orchestra. We'll talk or about the, that. We'll yeah. end with that. Yeah, yeah. game awards because shout, be shout out to them. No, let's just bring it up now. Okay. So, okay. So from Bastion Transistor to Supergiant. Uh, yeah, the game awards has done a very excellent job. Shout out to Jeff Keighley. I love the guy. I think he's faltered here and there in some years. Some years are better than others in terms of the way the show is presented. I mean, each award show uh, is basically. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's also live. So stuff goes wrong. Um <laughs> You remember, Lexi, when people, the kid got on stage when oh, Elden, Elden Ring won Game of the Year? All I remember the, is The, the, the Bill Clinton was, kid, as the people referred him to? All I remember about that is someone was talking about... I was watching someone do a video of all the games that they played in that year, and they talked about Elden Ring, and they showed the awards. Sarah, the, the guys going up for the award, the kid went in the background, they played the imposter music from Among Us. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. Well, yeah, I remember watching it and I'm like, it's funny because I didn't notice the kid in the background, but you got um, Miyazaki, the creator of Elden Ring, Dark Souls, all that stuff, go out stage, accept the award, his translators translating for him, I believe. And like his group is behind him, right? Well, turns out somebody's not supposed to be there. It's some random kid some random uh eastern european kid is like standing in the background with them with long hair and he looks okay. like 18 19 or something I like that i want to know how he got on stage so he how walked he got- up with them so that he was like uh he they were walking by and he just walked right in with them and right as miyazaki got done talking the camera goes to the wide shot of the stage and like uh, it, 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 it's about to close and then you hear his voice on the microphone you're like wait what he starts saying i want to dedicate this reward to my my one my lifelong mentor bill clinton and then like in that same wide shot before it cuts back to him start talking you see security swarm the stage like from all angles and you're like whoa it's just like little dark ants like moving in on him (laughs) and like miyazaki and them were like who is this guy what the heck and then like and i was a little behind on the live stream so like i went to twitter randomly because i was bored at one point (laughs) and everybody started saying it's the bill clinton kid bill clinton kid i'm like what the heck are they talking about and i'm like oh thanks for spoiling elden ring one game of the year and then (laughs) i get to that clip and i'm like what the heck what? So they 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 got assumedly better at their security. They, they last year they did really. I think last year was a really really good year. Okay, so it's funny. So Elden Ring happened that year, right? Mm-hmm. The next notable one I would say is when Christopher Judge won Best Performance for God of War Ragnarok. And after this, we're gonna talk about the music. But he gets up there, Lexi, and the music starts playing like probably forty five seconds a minute after he starts talking. Right? Oh no! He keeps going. And he keeps going and he <laughs> they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. He went for eight minutes talking about his acceptance speech and like I'm surprised was, security didn't get up. I, I, yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> well, like they played the music and I'm like, we're I'm watching this and everybody is like, oh dude, Jeff's probably like, dude, what the heck is he doing? Why won't he get off the stage? <laughs> and then they came back last year and made fun of it, which was really nice. Like he comes up to start give an award and, for, and then he's like, he starts talking and immediately as he starts talking, the music starts when he's like, <laughs> you mother of us. Oh he really, really, he's like, oh, dang it. And then he walks away and then he's like, oh, I'm joking. All right. All right. I let's think, get, let's I present think, the award. I think you have a particular <laughs> soft, like, uh, I think you have a particular soft spot for this last year's game awards because they did the song from Alan Wake. Yes. Um, like that, that, I haven't played Alan Wake 2, but I'm playing through the Remedy games right now. And Alan Wake 2 has this like whole dance sequence and song in the game that's actually in the game. And you can look it up on YouTube. And it's like amazing. So there's that. But the orchestra is what we're talking about. The one cool part about the Game Awards, as we get it, we finally get into the point where we brought in the Game Awards. Okay. (laughs) There's a lot of wacky stuff with it. Pretty great show. Last year was a little fumble in a lot of ways. But anyway. We're not going to get into that. The orchestra, they have played live throughout the entire thing, kind of like the Academy Awards, which was really neat. Um, and the orchestra is really cool because they play, before they present Game of the Year, they play the main theme and a whole suite of all of the games that were nominated for Game of the Year. So say you had... There was Last of Us. Last year you had, for example, Alan Wake 2. You had 
Oh my God, I'm blanking on games. Me you too. Alan I Wake Two, you, like you had Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, Tears Alan, of the Kingdom. Alan Wake Two, you had all these games that they would like, like merge into each other, and like they would play them and have their own separate portion throughout the uh, them playing it, and then they would go into the next one, and then they'd they bring did. Out, they they did so the transition into each song was so well. They would transition, done. and it was really cool. They would always do this. It's such a cool, unique thing that they do, and it's awesome because it also honors the music of video games, which is awesome. So. Yeah, as well Tears as, of the like, Kingdom had a banger. Oh, dude, theme yeah. In the trailer, like in that last trailer, it's mm-hmm. like as soon as you hear Link, you hear that saxophone. It's like, dear, dear, saxophone. Dear. Like, do you remember the trailer where it's I like so. he yeah. will be our last line of defense? And Zelda goes, Link, and then saxophone. It, there's a saxophone. No, there's not a saxophone, Lexi. It's that a, is a saxophone. I'm not gonna look it up right now. It's not a saxophone. How did you see? Lexi, the trailer before the game came out, right? Yeah, it was the last trailer. It's not a saxophone. That's like an altophone or like a flute or something. Haven't you seen the meme? Or a trumpet? Are you talking about a trumpet? No, have you seen the meme with the seal with the what? <laughs> saxophone going in circles? People are like, this is the, the, the breath of the, the Tears of the Kingdom trailer. And it's like, dear, 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 dear. It's like. Lexi, that's not a saxophone. That's something else. I don't know. It, what it sounds is. I'm like not a musically sa- inclined, so I don't know what it me is. Me either, but I don't even it remember sounds like what it sounds like. Saxophone to me. We're having the harpsichord argument all over again. Okay, it's probably a something. Anyway. So. But anyway, about Super Johnny Games going back to it, I just think that concert was really well done. It's really amazing if you look up what um if like what kind of video game music like they have concerts for. Mm. Like cuz they did the Super Giant oh, games. Oh, cuz they have like dedication concerts to like Final Fantasy, oh, yeah. the Zelda, the Pokémon Symphony, Pokemon Orchestra, Symphony Orchestra, the Zelda Kirby Symphony. 25th anniversary. There's a Kirby Orchestra going around? Oh yeah, the Gourmet. What? Yeah, the, the Gourmet Tour? No, it's the so you know the song. I'll da, look this up. Da, 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 yeah, da. yeah. So they orchestrated that, and that was a six and a half minute track. This is an orchestra that tours just for Kirby. This was for the anniversary of Kirby. Gourmet Kirby tour. Is this what you're talking about? I didn't say gourmet. I said gourmet race. That's the name. Oh, of that the track. gourmet race. Yeah. But um, yeah. So they have Kirby ones. I know they have Final Fantasy. Um, I looked up. They had Skyrim 10th anniversary concert. Oh my god, that'd be awesome. Um, they had an Undertale one in 2019, and then. They were going to premiere it on YouTube. And then when quarantine hit, Toby Fox released it. And they did it in Japan. It was a Japanese orchestra that specializes in video game orchestra. And they recorded it when they went on tour. And it was really funny. Toby Fox came (laughs) out. Of course, he had a bag over his head. And he put out the dog plushie of the dog in the game. (laughs) You can buy this right now on tobyfox.com. So you can buy the soundtrack for the live performance. Okay. But only on Fangamer, the Japanese Wait, website. Wait, they orchestrated the Undertale soundtrack? No, they did a live uh, performance of covers of Undertale. Oh, okay. Music. So they did chip tune and all that stuff. No, they did. Um, that's what I'm saying. It's orchestrated. It's orchestrated, yeah. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah, and okay. that one was really pretty. Um, I actually did that my last semester of college. I took music, um, <laughs> music history or, you know, um, I don't remember what it's called, but... Um, for because it we had to do everything online. It's like oh, you have to watch a concert and then review it and <laughs> point out stuff that you learned during the semester. And of course, I had to choose Undertale because I'm like, it. yeah, I was like, I'm not doing that. Um, I was like, yeah, classical music is good, but I like this. <laughs> Life is good, <laughs> like, but it could be better. <laughs> yeah, but um, if you if you're interested, like I would look up like video game if you're interested. Orchestras, yeah, yeah, orchestra. It's really cool how they take those tunes that you know and like they orchestrate them. And yeah. it's a nice different way of hearing yeah. um music yeah. that you like or something. Yeah. I don't know what I'm saying. Well, it's good. It's good stuff. Um speaking of orchestra, I